Good morning, good evening, good afternoon. Kamari Ellis here with another edition of Ask Kamari. Today I'm going to answer a question from a good friend of mine who asked me, Kamari, what are some good gifts to give a child to help them learn about investing in money? So I put together a list. Uh, the list will go um, from least important to the one I feel is the most important. So starting off with number five. Number five is a subscription to the Wall Street Journal. I think a subscription to the Wall Street Journal will be very, very helpful, especially if you read the articles to the child or with the child and then discuss, you know, what's going on with them and what's going on around the world. Uh, the Wall Street Journal is one of the most popular financial publications um, that we have right now, and everyone knows it. It's definitely recognized as an authority. But as an aside, I would also say that you can get the money section of the USA Today. Very well written written in everyday language and I think it's something that everyone could understand but again read the articles with the child to the child and then talk about them and just get more familiar with you know with money and money topics and discussions uh, number four on the list would be one of my favorite games of all time Monopoly uh, I used to play Monopoly all the time with my friends uh, during the summertime I think you know for probably five summer street every day in the summertime we play Monopoly but I, I think it's a favorite clearly I am biased but I'm just letting you know that up front um, but my Monopoly teaches you uh, it's a great way it's really really fun plus children don't play board games that much anymore so it's something you can do I know they also have a computer version uh, but it's something you can go over with, with. it's very centric on real estate uh, you know that's just one way to make money and, and build wealth but it helps them see you know what it's like to get a paycheck what it's like to pay rent what it's like to you know get a dividend possibly go to jail possibly pay taxes um, and so forth and so on so I think that's definitely a good one the next one I, I think is a really really good is a game pioneered by the author of Rich Dad Poor Dad by the name of Robert Kiyosaki and his game is called Cashflow 101 I love this game I actually love it more than I love Monopoly but it's a bit on the expensive side but I think it's worth it um, and a, an investment in your child's education will pay off mega mega dividends so um, think about that as we go forward but they also have a free version online so the reason why I like this game is because it, it compasses everything in your financial life whether it's car payments student loans buying braces for your children getting a divorce uh, <laughs> Uh, rental property payments, investment payments, uh, and so forth and so on. The overall object of the game is to get out of the rat race and make it into the fast track. And most of us who know, you know, who live paycheck to paycheck, know that they don't want to live paycheck to paycheck. They want to eventually be able to have the financial freedom that everyone has been talking about, which has become so popular, um, and, and, and be able to do and see the things that they want to do and see in their lifetime. So that's uh, number three on the list. Number two on the list is a practice account. People advertise them all the time. There, there are several of them with brokers and brokerages that will allow you to open up a mock account where you can practice trading stocks, bonds, ETFs, um, currencies, and things like that. Just paying attention to the ebbs and flow of the marketplace can open up your child's mind to a whole nother world and it could really, really begin to see things differently if you know you and your child go through this together. Number one on the list, number one, buy a stock certificate. Many people don't realize you can buy one share of stock. Um, and there are services out there, and I'll highlight them on, again on the blog, the blog post, um, where you can buy gifts for people for birthdays, Hanukkah, Christmas, Kwanzaa, whatever you like, and buy one share of stock. And you can have it framed, and you can talk to them about it. Again, we keep coming back to this. Uh, talking, communication, uh, just opening up the dialogue. Uh, it's very important. But, you know, if you brought one share of McDonald's and you talk to your child about them, about, you know, not necessarily getting a Happy Meal, but understanding how that Happy Meal drives McDonald's bottom line and then how that bottom line then drives the stock price, I think they might be a little bit more interested. And you can begin to see how the change of price in the barrel or, excuse me, a bushel of potatoes could also change that stock price as well. So those are my five top tips, uh, stock, stock certificates, practice accounts, cash flow 101, Monopoly, and the Wall Street Journal subscription slash USA Today subscription. Um, I think will, will definitely help to empower your child 
to live a life of financial freedom. If you have any other questions uh, for me, you can always hop over to AskAmari.com. You can hit me up on Twitter at AskAmari, or you can find me on Facebook, again, at AskAmari. Until the next time, have a peaceful, pro prosperous, and profitable day. I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.